Hey guys, welcome back. Now we'll be seeing how to make a tapered bar. The question is regarding a tapered bar. It has a force of 1000 Newton acting on the right end and the left end is hinged. The area of the cross section of the bar on the left end is 1000 mm square and on the right end is 500 mm square. The length of the whole tapered bar is nothing but 375 mm. Young's modulus is 2 into 10 power 5 newton per mm square. The solution is given below which will be discussed later. Open answers, go to file, clear a new start, do not read file, ok. This creates a new file. Go to preferences. Structural, OK. Go to preprocessor, element type, add, edit, or delete element. Click on add, link, 2D spare 1, OK. Close it. Go to real constants, add, edit, or delete element. Click on add. Close. The area, the first area is nothing but 875. Once you add the either side area and divide by 2 and again add the area of the either side and divide by 2 you get 875. Area of second one is 625. Okay. Upper, okay. Close it. Now go to material properties. Material modes. Go to structural, linear, elastic, isentropic. The Young's modulus is 2 into 10 power 5. That's 2 E5. Poison's ratio is 0.3. Close that. Go to mod. Go to modeling. Create key points in active CS. The first one is at 0, 0. The second one is at a distance of 187.5. Second in the x direction. Now just go to the third point. 187.5 plus 187.5 375 click ok now go to lines lines straight line select the first point to 1 to 2 click ok again go to the line 2 to 3 ok go to mesh Go to mesh attribute, pick lines, pick the first one, click OK. Real constant set number, let it be 1. Go to pick lines again, click on OK. Go to pick lines, click on the line, click on OK. Real constant number 2, OK. Go to size control, manual size lines pick lines click the first click on the first line second line click ok number of divisions is 10 ok close it go to mesh tool mesh click on both the lines click on ok meshing is done go to loads define loads apply structure displacement on key points click on the first key point click ok use all dof ok go to force and moment on key points click on the last one ok the force is 1000 ok now go to solution solve current ls it's being solved oh, cancel that Go to general post processor, element table, define table, add them, go down, go to by sequence number, ls, ls1, ok, close it, after that go to plot result, sorry, yeah, plot result, contour plot, nodal solution, go to dof solution, x component, click on ok, because it's in the x direction, Take those values down, write them, 
that's nothing but the deformation value it's almost similar got element table yes average okay so we got a stress value that's 1.143 and it's 1.142 over here and it's 1.6 and 1.6 over here go to list result reaction solution okay here we got our fx and fy value thanks a lot for watching guys see you again